I would like to invite Aruj Fatima from class 4 to deliver her speech on women empowerment. Esteemed Chief Guest, Honorable Guest of Honor, Respected Principal Ma'am, Vice Principal Ma'am, Staff Member and all wonderful personalities. Assembled here, wish you a grand and pleasureful afternoon one day and all. It gives me immense pleasure that I am asked to dance this one day institution where we get the real meaning of education and all aspects of life. No, I want to throw a light on our topic which is women empowerment. According to me, women is patient gift of God in the world. Women empowerment refers to making women powerful to make them capable of deciding for themselves. Women have suffered a lot through the years at the hands of men. In earlier centuries, they were treated as almost non-existent. As if all the rights belong to men, even something as basic as voting. As the time award women realized their power, during began the revolution for women empowerment. As women were not allowed to make decisions for the women empowerment, they may like a breath of fresh air. It may dumb aware of their rights and how they must their place in society rather than dependent on a man. Almost every country, no matter how progressive has a ill treating women in other worlds from all over the world have been able to reach the status they have today while the western countries are still making progress in India. India is the longest country which are not safe for women. There are various reasons for this. Firstly, women in India are in danger of honor killing. Their families think it's right to take their lose if 